Ah, uh, friends at Blackpool Tower for a minute. guys a bit of fireworks for the lights turn on and here we have got the illumination finally turned on in Blackpool hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video and in this video I don't be starting from Central Pier and making my way all the way up to Biston to show you a bit of the illuminations. So you wished you up, at least you know what to expect this year. made it to the gin roundabout and when you just look this way you can see this road all lit up from each side wow I do like it when it all lit up look incredible just everywhere you look it all lit up this is something near the Cliffs Hotel down the promenade heading towards Biston Way and it is about 10 o'clock at night now but I thought I need to leave it until a late one tonight so we can see the full potential of the lights we got And I finally made it right up to Biston. And just look at these, I always have these up in Biston every year. And they always bright up the walkway. I couldn't imagine how long it takes them to sort all this out for people to come and enjoy it. And for it to be free as well. That people can just drive the cars up here and just look out the window and just see these now like I said to appreciate it you do need to come out quite late hopefully the video will come out as good as I'm hoping because it is quite dark but we got some type of flickering lights Hope you all having a good weekend this weekend. I've been very lovely in Blackpool weather wise. Been a lot been happening with the switch on. And we have it like the ride the lights, run the lights, the car the car show. All in like a week in Blackpool. 
It looked like we got like a couple of suns now. Is that meant to be like the four seasons maybe? I'm not too sure. This is my favourite one coming up. I think it's the one on like a bike and then do like a jump. Yeah, that might be the four seasons maybe. You might have like the wind, the cold and the sun. And just a green one. Oh yeah, here we got the teddy bear picnic. That always oh, a nice little classic as well this being here for as long as I can remember. And of course we got a bike, what goes around the loop. Oh, we seem to be getting ready to be going around. How many do we go? Oh, I've not done it this time. Oh no, no, maybe now. Oh no. Oh, he's catching up the speed a bit now. Now he's gone all the way to the other side to jump up and then come all the way back again. And of course, we've got like a peacock right there with battle brush. I remember this when I was uh, younger. And don't know if he's still on TV, he's probably yes. We've got Postman Pat just up at the top and Sweep and Snooky. I remember these when I was growing up, also seeing them on TV. That was hell. Hopefully, the camera is doing it justice. There we go. We got like a a TV and we got that tram coming back going back into Blackpool it do look nice though don't it life without limits eh Richard and so do you, do you take that out? And then we got the good old SpongeBob and uh, Dora with that backpack. What seemed to fit? What seemed to fit anything in? And then we got Noddy. My sister used to be obsessed with this when she was younger. On Milk Sake Channel Five. Oh, I don't know what this one is. You got two eyes. You got like an um, ice cream truck on there. Lollies in oh. Lollies in love with. Oh, I don't know. It'll say lollies in love. Well, you're not saying no L. And then they're coming to the end of these now. I can see the classic Doctor Who's back again this year. We've got like a space one here. That look actually looks quite funky. I like, I like the look of that one. Yeah, I do like the look of that one. Lights around the world. I'm sorry if this is a long video, but I don't really want to be chopping a lot out. But it is the illumination, and they do go on and on and on. 
got like a I'm not too sure what this one is, that's from. Whatever it is, they seem to be blinking. Let me just show you the Doctor Who. There we got the phone box and the garlics. I will stop in the middle of them, give you a moment to have a look at them. This, so you got a couple of Daleks and the phone box. Let's carry on going. Under the lights, down the promenade. Here we got a donation pump. Are you ready to go to space? I think new people are right over here. And here we got a bit of a haunted hotel. Ready for Halloween, what just round the corner. And this one is to do with Collar Island. I never knew Collar Island did one for the lights. But hey oh, we learn something new every day. Coming up to the last couple now. And what is a nice bright colourful one this one is. And the Blackpool lad himself just told me this is Furry Godmother. But I I think I've seen it before, but I can't be too sure. So, it is wrong. And then, it is down to the Blackpool lad himself for giving me false information. But yeah, you got some nice, bright, colourful ones right here. And we're coming up to the last one, just right here now. Oh, here we got some cows hiding in a box and coming out. They look a bit like a... Oh, oh, I don't know. The door is closing. Oh, now we're back out of the box again. Wonder would this door open up in the next two minutes? Well, not hopefully not two minutes, but hopefully it'll open up and we can catch it on camera. The minute I stop recording, the minute it opened up. So there you go, we made it to the other side. Just so you know, I'm not lying. The light stopped literally right there. And you got Red Bank Road just literally right down there. So if you enjoyed that video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos of Blackpool, then please hit that subscribe button. And if you don't want to miss any upcoming videos, then please turn that notification bell. I'll see you on the next one.